tools from the bones of animals from 1.5 million years ago were discovered. Archaeologists in Tanzania found bone tools hippos and elephants that were made 1.5 million years ago. The Stone Age was the period in which our distant the ancestors learned to make tools from all kinds of rocks. However, however, despite the name of the era, at least some ancient craftsmen instead of the stones were using bones. It is not clear when this practice has become commonplace, but recent finds from Africa suggest that it was already 1.5 million years ago people had mastered this art. In the Old Away Gorge in the northwest of Tanzania archaeologists came across 27 tools made from the bones of large mammals, mainly hippos and elephants, but also other animals. The discovery indicates this, that our ancestors used bones as a raw material to make tools significantly earlier than previously thought. Results and description of bone tools were published in the pages The Writings of Nature. Tools are manufactured and used by our ancestors from ancient times. Representatives of the genus Australopithecus, which belonged to the famous Lucy and incomplete skeleton discovered in 1974 in Ethiopia they made stone tools 2.6 million years ago. But but the bone tools appear much later. For the ancient craftsmen of the bones were attracted the raw material, they found in large quantities, also in places without rocks, which were used to produce tools such as quartzite, flint or, basalt. In addition, the bones of the legs of large animals are ideal for tools, from because of its shape. And they are much lighter than rocks. But determining when exactly the tools were made from the bones remain elusive. Unlike stones, the bones in unfavorable conditions may be decomposed. For this during the work excavator bone tools can be difficult to distinguish from broken bones, which are usually found in archaeological sites. Although it is different researchers reported sporadic examples of earlier bone tools as for example, a hand axe from 1.4 million years ago. The prevailing view that production of this prevails the type of tools began only about 500,000 years ago. However, the finds from the Old Away Gorge undermine this narrative. The Old Away Gorge is a position with a long history of discoveries known to everyone the archaeologists. In the 1960s, Homo remains were discovered there Hubilis with the tools he made. They found there also the remains of the Australopithecus and Homo erectus, which is considered indirect the level between the Austroprocos and the modern man. For this the gorge had dozens of different tools and hundreds of animal bones. The latest discoveries are based on excavations in Oldaway carried out in the years 2015 to 2022. Scientists have spent several seasons on excavations to study how technology has changed when Homo erectus replaced Homo habilitus in the region, somewhere between 1.8 and 1.5 million years ago. In the publication, scientists described 27 tools from bone found in a layer dated to 1.5 million years. First. Researchers discovered bone elephant legs with distinct traces of shaping and sharpening. Then they found another, mainly made from the bones of large animals hippos, elephants, and cattle. Many of them could be identified as tools because they had traces of detachment that formed when it was given the shape to the edges. Scientists believe that hewn bones, along with stone tools also found in these layers, they were used as cutting cutting tools meat and bone splitting to get a nutritious marrow. To give shape to bone tools, ancient craftsmen they used techniques similar to those used during flint processing. It is up to Phi shows they were able to transfer the technique already used for manufacturing stone tools and apply it to another material. It is the same population hominins producing stone and producing tools bone tools said Jackson and Jaw, 
a paleoenrologist at Indiana University Bloomington and co-author of the study. Although no hominin remains found next door the tools, the researchers suspect that they were the work of Homo erectus. Technologies and technologies transferred from rock processing to make bone tools give a momentous image transformation in tool manufacturing. This is a big cognitive change, ours the ancestors had to understand the properties of bones, which differ from the properties the rocks. This is a significant step in evolution, Nja said. <laughs>